That's stupid. That's stupid. That's stupid. This is the discussion, if you can call it that. Yeah, please, 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 towel, towel, towel. He's stranded. Needs whoa, help. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> How do you feel about this this place, these these surroundings? I mean, it's awesome. I mean, I've been here last year, like three months ago, basically, and getting back here, it's it's a wonderful club. I love Italy. It's uh, it's good food, good lasagna. Does he say, Jerry, please default me? Yeah, I don't want to be here, <laughs> I think. Well, there we go. Ultimate respect from Alexander Bublik, who threw everything at this kid today. Game set and match. Sinner. Two sets to love. Six two six two. When you make a, <laughs> a plate, uh, uh, when you make a salad and you, you are putting ingredients inside the salad, he has, uh, I mean, uh, plenty of ingredients to become a, a great player. So um, that's, that's, the, that's the main thing. And uh, then, of course, nothing is easy. You're going to have uh, big opponents in front. Uh, I mean, nothing is easy in this life. And be one of the best players of the world and fight for the most important titles. Is something very difficult, but but I really believe that he's one of the guys that he can do it. Voy a hablar español o inglés. Como quieras. Italiano, no, italiano, no. <laughs> yeah, he's not looking happy, Medvedev. And... I don't want to play here on this circuit. Well, pretty clear what he's thinking. Yeah, Mateo, Mateo's team is bigger than Floyd Mayweather. Yeah. <laughs> I need help. I had the match uh, under control at the beginning, uh, playing well for six games, uh, probably playing better than him. Then in the in the four two serving for five two, <clears throat> I did a disaster. Uh, he, he read it yeah, uh, in the end. Boucher knew it was going there, but just Boucher. When you hit it for the line, I didn't know where it was. I just stuck my out. That you talked about the banter. Yeah, yeah, reliving that shot, you know, reliving that point. My match was today at 9 p.m. So during the day, I had a lot of time. So I decided to sleep. Normally, I, I don't sleep at all during the day. Or even if I try to sleep, I never fell asleep. And today, I fell asleep more than for, for one hour. <laughs> it's all happening. Can you imagine? Because I had the ball to hit. You didn't have any ball to hit. Can you imagine how stupid this call is? You cannot this is going to be on tennis TV, bro. No, it's a quite simple quote my dad taught me when I was very young, and uh, I think he actually has it from. Well, now we're in his country, but my dad used to go to a academy called Rick Macy, 
And he would always tell my father, because he played before, that uh, losers find excuses and winners find a way. So this is a quote my dad has been telling me for many years already, and it uh, comes from Rick Macy, I guess. So if Rick is watching this, I've never met him, but uh, he, he should have some creds for, for maybe the win I had today. <laughs> second serve but he didn't really get hold of it did he mate what is that oh. again sets and then two sets to love 6176 Look up to you a lot, kid, man. I want to see you play for many more years, bro. Have you have more years than that? Come on, bro. Come on. Yeah! Rain time. Quite in time. Thirty fault. Good relation. All of the Lieutenant team warning Mr. Shabuwa. Tell me what I said and you can quote me. Tell me. What did I say? I didn't say anything bad. For me, it sounded like a bad word. That we no, I didn't know. say anything bad. Okay. Where you go? Go play. Nobody's watching this part and you still quote me, man. We're doing a great job. Jabuwalov gonna thrust those three games to two. Left in that purple t shirt. Thank you. Thank Enjoying a court side. And I put alarm at 6 p.m. And when I wake up, it was already so dark. And I feel completely broken. Like when you, if someone wake you up at 7 a.m. And I was thinking, no, I'm not going to wake up now. I'm going to sleep for another half an hour. Siamo reinventando Rafa, io e forse Roger, il next gen. Next gen siamo noi. Anche il signore Petrangelo, il next gen. Like, I, I love it. I love playing tennis. Um, sorry. Sorry. Um, yeah, and like obviously competing is why you put in all the hard work. And in the last few years, I've not got to do that as much as I would have liked. So, yeah, just great that I'm out here and able to compete again. Normally, in the morning, I put many alarms. Uh, like this, I can sleep longer. <laughs> At least mentally, I think like this. This is what happens when you practice with Andy Murray.
comes through a nighttime Cincinnati classic. One of the great matches, one of the great comebacks from Zverev. He's not wrong. Unbelievable when they play. A double breakdown in that deciding set with Sasha. Not feeling particularly well either. Well, Rafa and I had a little laugh today in the locker room um, after I, I won against Titipas and you know, we kind of um, joked around about, you know, <coughs> that the old guys are still not giving up, you know, and, um, you know, I, I saw he said somewhere a few days ago that we're, that Roger, him and I are old, but uh, I don't, I disagree with him. I think uh, we're, we're showing, we're showing some different uh, fresh energy, you know, but we, we had a laugh about it. and. Nothing he can do. He's annoyed at that, Evans, but. What a laser from Musetti. <laughs> now he's being sarcastic. Um, I hope tonight was a, a bit of an uplift, maybe, to everything that's going on in the world. And then I start to realize, oof, I fell asleep during the day. Oof, I have a match to the, in a couple of hours. So I need to wake up. And yeah, it was just a moment like that.